This is Jim Ball reporting in White House. We came out to White House this evening to meet with David and Sonia Sherman. They are the parents of Zoe Sherman, who's been missing for three days now since Monday evening. Monday night, sometime between the hours of about 8 and 10 p.m. I uh, went out to um, pick up my daughter from work, and I noticed that her bedroom window was open. Uh, so I went up to check her room, and it was empty. She would obviously jumped out the window. And she took um, her toothbrush and um, some razors and at least two pairs of shoes, a couple changes of clothes. The police have um, gone through her cell phone and called every contact in her cell phone. Um, they've gone through every possible lead that any of the kids at school have come up with, rumors that they've heard of where she might be, um, extended family that lives in another county. They've gone out there. They, they campused the Walmart in town today, showed her picture to everybody. Um, they've now released it to news media. Um, they've also um, interviewed um, her, her boyfriend, his mother, um, everything that, that has even been a hint of a whisper of something that might connect us to Zoe, they have gone through. We asked the Shermans if Zoe had ever run away before or if they had any idea why she may have gone. No, no. not like this. No. We had a, a very brief, um, I would, you know, as far as arguments go, I'd say a normal type of argument that all families have. Um, you know, she had broken a rule. We talked about it. She was upset about it. She went to her room. Um, but when David checked on her, she was quietly watching a movie in her room. So we thought, give her time to calm down, and then we'll sit down and have a family discussion, which is normally right. what we would do to solve that. Zoe, we love you so much. And no matter where you are, no matter what you're thinking, the necklace that you gave me for Christmas, you have the other half. We're not whole without you. We want you to come home. Please, please, please don't think that there's anything, anything that should keep you from being here, from being home with us. We love you. We want you to come home. Please come home. Zoe, just like Mom said, we love you. Um, we just want you to come home. Um, it's not the same without you. You're part of our family and we just want you to come home so that we can all be together and be whole again. If you have any idea where Zoe Sherman might be this evening, then don't hesitate to call the White House Police Department. Even if you think your clue is insignificant or too small or maybe you feel silly, give it to the White House Police Department and let them decide what it means. Remember, sometimes the tiniest clue can be the case breaker. The White House Police Department can be reached at 615-672-4903. This has been Jim Ball reporting for SmokeyBarn.com's Robertson County Daily in White House.